Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions. Thank you for our time together. I want to come back again to the book of Proverbs, chapter 20, for just a minute. Every year, we do something called the Grads Banquet. And this year, it was such a privilege and honor. I mean, there were so many cum laudes and magna cum laudes. And oh my goodness, we have some. Sometimes, to be honest, as your pastor, I sit there and I look at these young people and I go, what qualifies me to stand in front of such incredibly intelligent young people and teach them the Bible? I mean, you know, we have, we have genius young people in the church, and I'm so proud of them. But each year when I sit down at the grads banquet, one of the things I teach them is to play to their strength. So let me talk to all of you young people out there. Proverbs 20, verse 29. The glory of young men is their strength. The gray hair of experience is the splendor of the old. Now, I don't have much gray hair up here, but I got some gray hair here. As you get older, experience and wisdom is your great strength. Your physical strength, you know, you, you don't feel old, but you don't bounce back as quick as you used to. And you think, man, I used to be able to go a lot longer than I'm going now. But young people, I look at you. I look at those eyes full of brightness and eagerness, and I, I look at the strength that you walk around in. Young people, you may not have a lot of wisdom, and you may not have a lot of experience, but you have strength. If you want to get ahead, play to your strength. Your strength is your strength. Now, when I was first your pastor as a young man, I was strong, just like you young people are strong now. I could go three days and not sleep, but it took me a lot longer to do things in those days. I can remember in the early 80s, we did not have computers yet. You know, you, you studied your Bible with concordances and Greek commentaries, and you'd have 30 books open, and it took, I used to take as much as 40 hours to write one sermon. Now, I can do that same sermon. Well, I do a lot of studying in advance, but it probably takes me about five or six hours to finish a Saturday, Sunday sermon. Now, after, you know, I've got outlines laid out and a lot of preliminary research, but it probably only takes me five or six hours now. But I've got these fantastic computer things, and it's, it's awesome. When I was young, it took a lot longer, but I had the strength to do it. Young people, it's going to take you longer to do things, but you've got the strength. Be the first in your office be the last to leave in your office. Work harder than everybody else around you. Work longer than everybody else around you. Your greatest strength right now is your physical strength. I don't say this insultingly, but you don't have a lot of wisdom yet. You don't have a lot of experience yet, but you've got a lot of strength. Do you want to get ahead, young people? Use your strength. Don't use your strength to play. Use your strength to build your careers and to build your businesses.